We begin at five with remembrances for a 17 year old found shot to death inside an abandoned Henderson home. Thank you for joining us. I'm Marie Mortier and I'm Jim Snyder. Matthew Minkler is his name. He's being remembered as a kind spirit. Two other teenagers in jail tonight accused of killing him. Minkler's body found in a home near Eastern and Horizon Ridge. That's where we find News 3's Antonio Castellan. Marie, this is a quiet Henderson neighborhood. People living here say this is hard to believe. Henderson police have not released the motive behind this killing. Family members describe 17 year old Matthew Minkler as a sweet boy. They say his loss is devastating. Early Saturday morning, Henderson police say they discovered Minkler's body inside this abandoned house off of Eastern and Horizon Ridge Parkway. The Clark County coroner says Minkler died of a gunshot wound to the head. I just can't believe something like that would happen in this neighborhood. Ron Schneider has lived in this neighborhood for 13 years. Schneider tells us he had no idea teenagers were inside the abandoned home. Henderson police say late Friday night, they discovered a group of teens driving recklessly in a stolen car. Police tried pulling it over, but the teen sped through a red light and lost control. The car crashed into the intersection, and that's when five teenagers ran from the car. Police detained them. And through questioning, learned two of the teens claimed they took part in Minkler's murder. People just don't have any respect for life anymore. You know? All these school shootings and everything that's going on. Henderson police have not released the ages of the two boys arrested on suspicion of murder. What the motive was behind Minkler's killing is unknown. Neighbor Armando Valdez says this is chilling to hear. What's happening? You know, it's just, it's just quiet neighborhood. Uh, you can even, I mean, you can leave your doors unlocked at night. Now, now, now it's not, not like that no more. Schneider believes if parents were more present in their children's lives, tragedies like Minkler's murder could be avoided. Not enough uh, parental control, I think, is probably what I see. Being an ex-teacher, you know, uh, all through my 40 years of teaching experience, I would see less and less parental involvement. The two juveniles have been charged with murder. Reporting live, Antonio Castellan, News 3.